Hey, I heard a term the other day that I've only ever heard in the medical field. What? And it's applying to tires. Okay, so oh, first of wait, all... Wait, wait, wait. Check. First, before we do anything else, click the like button, subscribe, and more importantly, bring, bring us, us your, your cars. cars. <laughs> okay, so what's the term that I heard? I don't know. I'm scared to ask. Are you going back to colonics? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's cupping. 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 Yeah, yeah, you know, like is that, at, is at that the, like is that like spooning? No, like at the Olympics, you know, you saw them with those red dots all over their shoulders and those big blotches. Okay. I thought those were hickeys. <laughs> hickeys. <laughs> Tire cupping. How do they get? How do they get those red dots on the skin? What does that do? What? We're not going to go into that because I want to know about tire cupping. What the heck is? Why? How do tires get cupping? I mean. Is this a real thing, Jerry, or is this like somebody was just yanking my chain? What is that about? <laughs> Boy, I, I could go off in lots of different directions, and I'm going to stick to the script that we don't even have. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> well, cupping is also called scalloping, okay? And that's, I like scallops. Oh, yeah, they're really good, especially when they're seared, seared properly. Oh, they get the little caramelized. Mm -hmm. Okay, but we dig, digress. Uh, scalloping or cupping is when you see uh, gouge marks every so often around the edge of the tires. And it is literally, if we take, take your little candle top, <laughs> pretend this is a tire, and there will be a, a, a divot. All the way around. So it's it's scalloped this way. It's not it's not this way. No, it's, it's not. It's gouging in this way. Yes, and I'll see if I can find some video uh, uh, that can depict what causes the scalloping, and what why it does that is. Let me borrow this again. So <laughs> okay. what happens is is one of two things: either the rear alignment is out. And people get only a front end alignment when their vehicle needs to have a a four wheel alignment. Mm. And so what will happen is, as that tire, the rear tires are going down the road, if they're off, they will start to chatter, and they'll just chatter a little bit. And as it's bumping the road, it erases that part of the tire. Same thing if the shock or the strut is worn, instead of it rolling smooth and going over the bumps the way it should, you'll see the tire actually bouncing up and down as you're going down the highway and this bouncing up and down as it as it skids if you will because it, it comes up and it begins to lose the inertia and slows down it hits the ground again and then there's that little rub or the little erase think about an eraser on a pencil and you're erasing it just a little bit but imagine now this car is going 60 or 70 miles an hour and you're really erasing it so rapidly. What does that feel like to the driver? Like what will the driver experience? What will they feel? You may feel a slight vibration. You may think it's just a, a problem in the road. Mm. Uh, you could, and depending on the car, you may not feel anything, right? And, and I mean, we just saw this, uh, we were driving up to the ranch the other day and we saw a, a Mercedes and the right rear tire was just bouncing like crazy. Compared to the front tire, the front tire was going along smoothly. Perfectly smooth, and yep. the rear tire was bouncing, yep. and, and it, I could see that it was causing a scalloping issue, even at 70 miles an hour. And scalloping, or uh, cupping, is something that you'll actually see on the tire. So check the full tread all the way around the tire, and you'll see if there's some areas where... And I'll, I'm gonna post some photos. Oh, I'll, okay. I'll attach photos to this video so you can see instead of us going with the little yeah. with the little uh, candle top and whatnot. Uh, but you'll, you'll My actually... My friend Tiffany <laughs> gave it to me. And so what does this chatter sound like? They're talking to each other? <laughs> Lord help me. <laughs> Please. <laughs> it's going to be one of those days, isn't it? <laughs> All right. So if you are having a vibration, a feeling while you're driving at higher speeds out on the highway, bring us your car. We'll look to see what's going on with the tires, the stress, the suspension. The All of it. it could just, you know, if you have a knows? vibration, it could be something as simple as the wheels need to be rebalanced. Mm. And rebalance is when we 
take the tire and the wheel assembly off the vehicle and we put it on a wheel balancer and we make sure that it spins smoothly and evenly and we do that by adding small little weights around the wheel okay and it could be on one side or the other side uh, either inboard or outboard side of the wheel so it could be something very simple balance Hopefully. the tires or it could be you need to have a four wheel alignment or it could be you need shocks or struts on the back or or maybe you hit a really big pothole and it and it bent something and that will also cause a sc a scalloping or cupping problem with your car. But so the idea is bring it by. Let's have professionals take a look at it and tell you exactly what's going on with your vehicle, so we can keep you safe on the road. And that's that's our number one that's mission: is the main keeping thing. you guys safe, keeping yeah. you safe on the road, and helping you do early maintenance now, so you don't have to do big maintenance later. Yeah, so, they used to have that commercial up by by Fram. Uh, about oil changes, it says pay me now or pay me later, right? Oh. And it's, you, you do a little payment now for the oil service, or you do a big payment later for for engine replacements, which brings me to another topic. We have three vehicles in here right now that we have to total. Their cars are totaled because we couldn't find replacement engines for them. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah. so that's that, a topic for another episode. That will be our next, episode. our next episode. So, like Jerry said, bring us your car so you can schedule an appointment at 972-578-0588 or online at www.theautoshop.com. <laughs> Make sure you click your like button, subscribe, and... Share this, these videos with your friends. See and, you next time. Yeah, bring us your car. That's Jerry. I'm Dr. Laura. <laughs> See you. Bye, everybody.